A man and woman are in custody after an overnight traffic stop in Pleasant Springs turned into a chase into Cottage Grove and an attempted shooting. The chase started in Pleasant Springs and deputies stopped the suspects spiking their tires in Cottage Grove, but the two suspects ran into the woods. Police warned the public overnight to lock their doors that these suspects were armed and dangerous. They had shot at deputies as they were speeding. Tony Galley reports law enforcement stayed the course despite the danger. A 30 year old woman's arrest in Cottage Grove. She must have just been laying in the trees back here. Comes after Amber Vernig and a passenger in her car, 38 year old convicted felon Michael Parks, are tracked down by deputies, dogs. Dane County Sheriff David Mahoney says a routine traffic stop hours before turned into a chase when Vernig and Parks took off and laser guided gunshots were fired at pursuing law enforcement officers. Multiple times deputies uh, reported seeing these laser dots. Um, I can tell you uh, in hearing the stories from the deputies involved in this pursuit that it was extremely scary. Vernig's capture after road spikes stopped the car and prompted the suspects to run came some hours after Parks was found. This thick grove of trees parallels streets here in this Cottage Grove neighborhood and certainly provides cover for the wildlife and in this instance for a suspected shooter. Now Doug Kinney owns this home and he woke up to a startling sight right here on his deck. I mean they had semi-automatic rifles and stuff and I thought this is a police matter. Parks arrested on the deck and throughout this ordeal. No shots were fired by law enforcement. I mean these people are shooting at the police. You know, that's 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 pretty hardcore. A combustible situation and safely in Cottage Grove, Tony Galley, 27 News.